Hello everyone, Hamel here going through the list of stocks that are setting up as a part of Code 30. First a quick disclaimer. Okay, so there are a few stocks that are in this group today. So Code 30 are the stocks that have a significant improvement in all three. Margins, earnings per share, and revenue or sales. So I covered some of this uh, in the video I believe Thursday night on my channel, so I'm not going to repeat the same information. I covered LH, which continues to be in a good setup. DHR, which I did buy Friday. That's my cost basis right there. It continues to be in a good setup. NVIDIA, I bought as well. And then Amazon, which I currently have positions as well. And then there is one more I would like to just highlight very quick. So it is the gold stock. So for some reason, gold is looking better. Now, with uh, Bitcoin going uh, really sky high, we would think that uh, gold would be selling off, but it is not. So just uh, need to keep that on the, on the watch here. So again, that's the Bitcoin right there, the, the fund at least, the tracking fund, just to be more precisely correct. So EGO, so let's look at uh, so this EGO and then another stock I want to just talk about very quick. So this one is, uh, Tightening up here, it is not as tight as I would like it to be. It's uh, about 14% wide. However, it is right along the 50 day moving average. And it's, uh, so if it breaks through above this level, then it may go, it may go higher from here. And with the market where it is, it may, it may pull back a little bit. So maybe gold may go up, not sure we'll have to watch. However, for a good entry, if you look at uh, the hourly chart, it's not really, we need this to set up in a tight range here, like it was here, like it was here, like it was here. So that is, this is not that. This is none of those uh, those uh, instances. However, let's look at uh, a little closer here. So earnings are going to actually go the negative, the, the wrong direction here. Uh, expanding sponsorship, it has uh, made good headway during the course of uh, this year. It is in a cup with handle on a weekly chart. Let's see here, a uh, few more, a little bit more information here. Okay, so if you look at the analyst target very quick here, again, these are just estimates. So upside is 40% gains from here, average is 24%. However, I already showed earnings are gonna not going to grow and revenue is also not going to grow. So in my opinion, there's another stock which I had a position a few days ago. New Newmont is looking similar. Now EGO obviously is in a much better configuration. However, this is also tightening up. It is more tighter than EGO. And I actually had bought it this here and I sold this here. So I sold it for very minimal gains. So I didn't really have a blockbuster trade there. Now. So one can buy this around here with a stop underneath here, which would be about 6% risk. Now again, looking at the uh, hourly chart, this needs to set, set up better in my opinion. So if it tightens up, then one can buy with a buy stop right around this. So, you know, it has to tighten up like this and then we can decide a better entry, whether an entry here or an entry on a breakout here. So this one, in my opinion, is a better stock better fundamentals. So when we look at this very quick, so it is not as stronger of a growth in last couple of quarters as EGO. However, it has been pretty strong over the course of time as gold has done well. So as we can see, growth is slowing down, but still far greater than a five yearly average growth of 18%, even for next year. And uh, expanding sponsorship, Fidelity Contra Fund is a, it's a really good fund that owns a small portion of it in a good dividend yield. And then if we look at uh, the estimates here, it is uh, estimated much more upside here. It's about almost 58% upside, average upside of 29%. And then earnings, as we saw, is going to continue to grow pretty healthy here. And revenue is also going to grow pretty good. So at least for one more year. So this may be a better option. Again, like I said, it has to set up more on an hourly chart. Only then I may be interested in buying. 
So let's see how this works. I'll be watching this uh, during the course of this week and see if it sets up. I may I may take a smaller position on this, but I uh, just wanted to go over this very quick um, as this one uh, EGO was setting up. So then I looked at NEM as well. So I hope you're doing well. Have a good one. Take care.